Only Liam, prima donna, minstrel boy, soprano. Fortescue 300 plus, the wench is a piano. Russell Brothers make their mark as Irish cleaning ladies. Tony Hart with Harrigan drags the 1880s. Lind is Swedish towards the world each night, a curtain call. William Dorsey Swan, the first to host a grand rag ball. Francis Reynolds wears his frocks for the World War troops. Barbet walks across a wire, never yelling, whoops. Bothwell Brown erotic, though never overwrought. Dwight Fisk plays the 88, his songs with sex are fraught. Bert Savoy in New York Broad with quips that predate bitchy. Jean Malin, our pansy host, speaks campy, patter, kitschy. Julian Elting, Broadway star, off stage, always a him. Phil Black, queen of costume balls, his name's an acronym. Carol Norman hits the notes, his vocal range confounding. Bruce Fletcher is writing songs, his lyrics are astounding. Here we are, 1940s, the time of Noel Coward. Ray Burini's making records, makes us feel empowered. Jose Sari, a nightingale, his parodies are lush. T.C. Jones, Jewel Box Review, those lampoons make us blush. Bessie Bonehill tours the States, makes her fortune as a male. Hetty King takes up the torch, covers music sheets for sale. Kathleen Clifford sells herself, the smartest chap in town. Annie Hindle marries gal in her tux and not a gown. Gladys Bentley stomps the keys, dressed up like a dandy. Spivy owned a juke joint club, which surely came in handy. Lynn Carter is Betty D. Laurie Shannon, Minette. Dorian Corey and Lady Divine, we will not forget. Jim Bailey and Harvey F. Danny LaRue, Lipsinka. Craig Russell and Damn, RuPaul, Lady Bunny's no stinker. Finish with our trinity, Charles Pierce, Ludlum, and Bush. After all, if you're still listening, I don't want to push.